You know, I'm not very familiar with Star Wars, but it was nice to see, be part of something with so many women involved. And that's just, I love it. I love being a woman. And Star Wars has been so patriarchal, even though I haven't really seen it. And it's just amazing to be surrounded by all these gay women. Nerdorotic.com. Dude, did you hear what the description was for the Acolyte? Really yeah, how they pitched it. How they pitched it. It's Frozen meets Kill Bill. Yeah. yeah. No. Oh my yeah. God. Sorry. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not whoa, Star whoa. Wars. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Say again. It's yes. Frozen, Frozen meets, meets Kill, Bill. Kill Bill. Okay, you're right. Thanks, guys. I've had fun tonight. Come on. <laughs> uh, someone said that Harvey Weinstein must be Olaf. <laughs> Dude, uh, the, the, they spent all day. I watched it at double speed. Uh, they spent all day talking about Disney Plus stuff. And the first hour and 40 minutes were like on and off acolyte stuff. And it was rough to get through. Here's a clip I saw. Uh, here you go. Jody Turner, SM, the acolyte here. No, she's a, she's a powerful yes. leader. She's a powerful leader. Yes. Yes. Oh yes. God. Yes. Very woman-centered world, which I, I was very excited to kind of be in that. Because I feel like Star Wars is, is very, like, patriarchal. So it was kind of cool to have, like, this sort of... Woman oh, sentence. isn't she being interviewed by the person who that had Reba? to? Uh, no, the one on the left yeah. had to delete tweets that were uh, racist. Isn't that the one? Oh, uh, I don't know. They have so many woke they black women working yeah. for hours and stuff. To they tell. had a, they brought on a couple hosts. One was for the High Republic, uh, mm -hmm. and one uh, had to delete tweets. Uh, Bounding That's had the one article. I made videos about that I got clipped up into and put in that one little uh, yeah. that one little montage from rewriting Ripley. I think. Yeah, uh, I don't remember. But let's look. Uh, it's because Star Wars it, been so. Are these people? And you know, she's really Sweet sort seals. of going through a struggle. Because I mean, that's Star Wars, right? Like, a struggle, going through a struggle. She's really I... kind of like <laughs> uh, in this sort of quandary. And that sort of her journey is, is to kind of go through this struggle between. <laughs> What? <laughs> what, what are you talking about? about? <laughs> when when Christina was Ariel was the one you were right? thinking yeah. about. <laughs> and Star Wars is a struggle, right? I'm, right? Uh, am I talking about the right It's a thing? patriarchal struggle. <laughs> See what really happens when adult pretenders session. go off script or when they don't have the, somebody writing the words for them. They have a very hard time. She's like Kamala. Well, yeah, just yeah. like you know, yeah. space. It's a big thing with it's stars empty and with a lot stars of space. and school buses There's are yellow and, and they have wheels and yeah. Patriarchal. What is she on? Queen Amidala. We got Princess Leia. Most on of Mothma. the on Mothma. On Mothma. On Mothma. On Mothma. Most of the leaders in Star Wars are women. What is she? She's doing? never watched it. Did she watch mm -hmm. the Ahsoka She's trailer? Never watched it. <laughs> I do have this. You have this. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes, that's the Christina that Ariel. I don't know if that's the person who's interviewing no, her. I don't know. I don't think so. I couldn't see the face. I, so. So. I couldn't see the face, and I'm obviously going to be racist we now, so I don't care. Uh, yeah, Jay just thought it was Reva. <laughs> yeah. It kind of looked like Reva from the side. <laughs> they needed. Do I don't think dark with enough. her. I don't think she was dark enough. She couldn't sell any lightsabers. <laughs> None. <laughs> it's pretty sad. Still not funded. After turning Luke Skywalker into a sad old man, <laughs> Disney announces a new film where Rey rebuilds the Jedi Order. Yeah. And this is the real one. This is like this not, is, yeah, yeah. not, this not the B. Yeah, like that's actually what they're doing. 15 years oh, after Rise of Skywalker, gosh. Rey will be rebuilding the Jedi Order. Oh. And they, they're calling the era the new Jedi Order. Like, <laughs> it's, like they, it's like they know they know I, that I, the I, real I, fans they're like fuck mm, them uh, fuck them we're gonna do it even harder we're gonna make it even worse i feel like I'm we're gonna use cold. air to the air empire we'll show you <laughs> haters we're gonna lose more money than you could possibly imagine <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna make the worst content <laughs> <laughs> screw you <laughs> i'll be honest with you guys this is what i want because it's gonna cause them to burn it to the ground yes. so yeah, yeah. I mean, acceleration. Very entertaining from acceleration. The um, it really is. Am I allowed to show a picture? No, no, what? no. Everybody <laughs> else is except for you. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah. Yeah. Hey. No, we don't want to see you. Not real. Before. No, no picture. <laughs> this is. Uh, I showed this on on Tuesday night's main event. This is the merch. <laughs> This is the merch that they're selling. This is the merch that they're selling at Galaxy's Edge. So if you go to, if you go, 
if you go to the uh, <laughs> Galaxy's <laughs> Edge, you want to buy the holiday special? If you want to buy merch at Galaxy's Edge, <laughs> this is what no, they I'm have. Good. Walk off God. into the stars. Oh. I'm okay. Yes. Walk what? off into the, to the stars. I wish you fucking would. I wish you would. <laughs> right? What's even better is the uh, the quality of the plushies of the merch they're selling. There's Chewbacca. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. oh my god! I bet that thing's like forty dollars. How much does that cost? Jojo. Uh, yeah. It's about Awful. it's about thirty two dollars. Why does he have like a cancerous what? testicle in his hand? Uh, That's yeah, the life. Is. That's the life day orb that yeah. Yeah. they have. Okay. Come on, Gary. Oh my god! Oh. Crap. That, that is garbage. Yeah. Oh. They don't even electrocuted. It, it's all that, and it's Baby Yoda merch. That's pretty much all they have. Imagine giving that freak show to your kids. <laughs> yeah, Dad, do you hate like, me? Yeah, why do you hate me, Dad? <laughs> what did I do? What did I do? Can I be adopted? I wouldn't yeah. even give that to a dog. <laughs> <laughs> it's impressive how bad this is. Like this yeah, is. I would have been more excited if they would have announced the Star Wars movie with Brie Larson at this point. That's that would have excited me. <laughs> oh my that god! Actually, look like her. That's no. Reva, right? I, no. No. Hey, no. You are. Oh, hey. Oh, oh, geez, fucking so racist, racist on the show, Jay. Jay all right? They don't all look alike. God, we Jay. get him on the show god. and he just goes all racist. Is that hey, Simu uh, Lou? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's that Andrew me. Miller. It's, that's Perry the Chan. That's Perry, Miller. what are you doing there? <laughs> oh my that God! Simu Miller. <laughs> I would say a battle for power. Mm. I mean, the best parts about mm. Star Wars is there is no good or evil. It depends on what side. What? You're what? Oh, what? <laughs> there is no good or what? evil. What? Good or evil. Just what? don't side wow. you on. Oh my yeah. god! What is this? Darth going Vader, on? the Empire, the Emperor, <laughs> Emperor, <laughs> oh, oh, you know, from evil to me. From a certain point of they, view, they Falcon destroyed Mello. a planet. They <laughs> that, that, is that is Hollywood. That is Hollywood, and Hollywood's. You culture. don't understand, don't Shad. Anymore. They were feeling oh, oppressed. Man. They were feeling marginalized. So they needed yeah. to blow up Alderaan, it was, it okay? Was a genocide white people. Wow. It doesn't count, Shad. You stopped yeah, the yeah, mocha yeah. lattes. We had to destroy yeah. the planet, man. Yeah. If you look at it from their point of view, like, it's holy crap. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Disney is, like, if you look at it from Hitler's point of view, I mean, you know. <laughs> from Star Wars. <laughs> you know. Oh. It's space fucking. It's World War II in space, you dipshit. That's oh, which side of the Nazis. What a statement. George Lucas always said that Star Wars was Anakin Skywalker, the tragedy of Anakin Skywalker, a good guy turning absolutely evil, period. Oh, mm. that, like, that comment was so astoundingly dumb. Someone needed to unironically slap him. Like the interviewer just there, <laughs> just like, excuse me. Like, like what, do you, what do you want? None of them have a fucking clue about Star Wars, what they're doing, why they're what there. morality for that matter. Yeah. <laughs> I just hate that they always have to sympathize the villain. Why does why do we have they to are the villain them? X-ray girl? Oh, That's are. why. That's who they identify That's with. What, they don't understand morality and good and evil, so they had they to really morph don't. Star Wars, which is something that is so like mm. good and evil, the dark side, the light side. They systematically made it go. No, there's there's the Bindu, there's the Gray oh. Jedi. It's all you know. It's uh, point of view. It's this perspective, and there's no good and evil. Yeah. Shad, it's an actor from the Acolyte. Acolyte, <laughs> holy crap. Well, that explains everything. Yeah, he's, he's just there to be gay, that. Shad. That's all he's there for. That's, <laughs> that's literally all he's there for. Well, if it's the black man, yeah, they have to make him gay. Because they always make the black man gay for some reason. Feminine. Because you yep. can't have masculine black men, that's why. Yep. yep. That's scary. Yeah, they're yeah, scary. You, you got to cut him out of the China posters. Uh, yeah, and sh <laughs> yeah. That, I mean, and that's that takes a lot of Photoshop time. Jay, which of these new uh, Disney Star Wars projects are you looking forward to the most? Um, none of them actually. <laughs> the canceled one. I want to be a story of Ray with what Grogu. The most? Ray with Grogu, and Grogu's going through his like teenage Groot phase, like his teenage Grogu <laughs> phase. <laughs> So like Ray just catches him fucking jerking off with the force. And <laughs> and shit like that. You know what I mean? I think uh, like, I, I think you do a lot with that type of a story. I think Ahsoka will oh, use God, the time travel and uh, oh. meet up with Ray in the film. 
with Baby Yoda on Batu making out in the Galactic Star Cruiser. Oh my god. Oh, look so at this these on the Acolyte talking about uh, how the they hate white people and straight story people. That was very personal to her that oh, fit yeah. inside the mm. Star Wars mythology. So that's kind of like the like the gold star of a filmmaker that you get to work with. And she's an absolute delight. We have a lot of fun. It's like working with your friend. Um, and your friend that fed of, you to, uh, to uh, Harvey and... Weinstein. Wait, you, hold on, hold on. This is a funny part. It's like working with your friend. Um, and there's lots of uh, hugging and crying and pushing oh each other. God. But it's been really, really fun. She's Let's talking about you... Leslie Hedlin, by the way. Oh, Former Harvey God. Weinstein Too ugly assistant. to be assaulted Leslie Hedlund. Yep. Jesus. What are they hugging and crying about? Uh, just being on the how show. difficult it is to make K a film? Killing Star <laughs> Wars. Oh my god, we're <laughs> killing yeah, Star we're Wars. Yay! Too uh -huh. ugly to be that. assaulted. Hey, 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 yeah, that's 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 a, you, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That one caught me off guard. I was like, holy shit. <laughs> it, it does just seem like, it, with the exception of the skeleton crew thing, which Jude mm. Law is a part of, mm -hmm. which that's going to tie into the Favro Filoni Mando thing. Like, with the exception of that, it does just seem like everything announced has just this focus on women. Yeah, you know, I, I think it's yeah. I think it's really hard to like not talk about that. I, the, like the Ahsoka series, I don't I, I'm not going as hard about all, how female focused that is specifically in and of itself because that's what I'd expect I will. from that series. That's Ahsoka. That's Hera. That's Sabine. These are the characters that were left over. These are the characters that were supposed to go on that mission. Now, I would be asking where's Rex. I, you could ask some questions like that. Sure. Then you have the acolyte. All they're talking about is the women. All they're fucking talking about is the women. You have Ray coming back to lead the series. Haven't heard oh shit God. about James Mangold's Dawn of the Jedi, but if they're going to rip off Dawn of the Jedi, the book, which why the fuck wouldn't they? That's another female lead. It, so it just, it's crazy. It, it is crazy yeah. that this is Star Wars Ka celebration. Kathleen Kennedy has a lot of built up resentment from her days in Hollywood. I mean, it's that's pretty apparent, pretty obvious. And, and Bo Katan supplanting Din Djarin. Yeah. Yep. Yep. It's star hers. This is the way. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. like fine if you want to have lead characters. Well, that's, that's fine, but the imbalance. It's so fucking imbalanced yeah. right now. Is, like, this just, is rebalancing. Uh, no necessary rebalance. No, you know, what, we know what's going to happen. The dudes will be uh, either Mansell's in distress or duplicitous or incompetent. Little puppies, or white, follow uh, villains. Or, uh, and Maybe white. even incontinent. <laughs> yeah. So if there was yep. balance, it's fine. We're, this perfect. isn't balance, though. This is, this is this is idiots doing the same stuff they have been doing for the last five years. Uh, and yeah. uh, I, I, I don't know how anybody could think uh, uh, any different, to be honest with you. This is why, like... I could care, like this is all funny. I think I could say I could speak for all of us. This is all pretty fucking funny at this point. Like, I I oh. don't care. I don't give a shit. Uh, yeah. Nerdrotic.com. Please subscribe. Hey, if you like what we do here at Nerdrotic Daily, please like, share, and subscribe. And if you could do that with your favorite YouTuber as well, I'm sure they would appreciate it as much as I do.